think there's been a lot of confusion and noise, if you will, in the industry, and um, uh, dealers have been quite frustrated, if you will, as to, in terms of where to focus. You know, there are a lot of ratings and reviews uh, sites out there. You've got Google, you've got Yelp, uh, Cars.com, Edmunds, in terms of specific automotive sites, and of course, dealer radar. And there has been a, a bit of um, confusion in the industry. If you're a dealer, you know, which one do you focus on first and foremost? So I think as dealers kind of move forward, it's really important to understand you do need to focus uh, on any review site that's going to come up or a consumer if, is searching online. So, for example, on page one of a Google search, if you're a dealer, you want to do a Google search and take a look at what review sites show up there um, and, and pay attention to gathering some content on those sites. But in any vertical um, you always want to try to emphasize and, and put the majority of your focus on the review site that is specific to your niche. So if you're in uh, hotels, you're going to focus on TripAdvisor, or you're in restaurants, you're probably going to focus on, on Yelp. If you're an automotive dealer, it's, it's critical to understand that DealerRadar is the largest niche site out there, and so the majority of your focus should be on building content on DealerRadar and then secondarily on cars.com and Edmunds and Google and Yelp. Certainly, um, you have to pay attention to those sites, but your focus should really be on the biggest uh, vertical, um, on the niche site in your vertical.